here in New Orleans. Welcome, everyone. We're broadcasting from WLAE Public Television in New Orleans, Louisiana. We've been here in the Gulf since Friday investigating the massive BP oil spill off the coast of Louisiana. We've talked to fisher folk who fear they won't be able to fish in the Gulf for years, to indigenous leaders who could lose their historical villages, to Alaskan elders who travel to the Gulf to share their stories about how they survived the Exxon Valdez spill. The anger at BP and the federal government is enormous. Throughout the week, we'll be broadcasting voices from the Gulf. Today we begin with a short clip from George Barisic. He's the president of the United Commercial Fishermen's Association. He spoke on Sunday at a large protest in New Orleans near Jackson Square. A lot of people losing sight of the poor 11 people who lost their lives. And a lot of, a lot of people want to have a moment of silence. I don't want that. So I want we going to clap. One second. 11 times. Let the people across this goddamn country understand. People got killed here. Yeah. And if it's not from gross negligence, it's at least negligence. Yeah. We got commercial fishermen out there, and I came in the other day, that could have got killed. Yeah. We need a body count before BP steps up. Yeah. So let's go ahead if y'all don't mind. Y'all ready? Yeah. Yeah. attending congressional hearings, meetings, all over the place, doing a lot of PR, thank God, to people like y'all, making it come up, to make people understand what's going on. And I've been trying all kinds of ways to make BP understand, but they don't. So I said, what can I tell these people out here a little different? Remember three words 200 something years ago, we the people. Right? We the people. Look at the people. All right? Well, the United Commercial Fishermen was started in 1993. It was we the fishermen. Because the government was putting us out of business. So now we need we the fishermen and we the people to keep doing what we're doing here. Because if we don't, they're going to sweep it under the floor, under the mat, like every other time. And look, the shrimp season over to late fall tomorrow. I'm going to strip it while I still can. Yeah. And I got some cards if anybody wants to buy some shrimp. Help me yeah. That was George Barisic, the president of the United Commercial Fishermen's Association. At a rally in New Orleans, hundreds turned out in the pouring rain. This is Democracy Now!, democracynow.org, The War and Peace Report. We've been here in Louisiana, going through southern Louisiana and the Mississippi Delta since last Friday. And our intention today was to bring you a special for the hour. But because of events in the Middle East, we are switching gears and we'll bring you many of the voices. We'll introduce you to many of the people we met in the coming days, right now. We